of Buddy Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. Today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Gate of Nightmares chapters 18 and 19. So before I get into this final live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone in this video, are not sponsored. If you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kick in so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our Cash App and PayPal links are in the description box below. So, I didn't realize this manga was ending today. Oh, no. Yoshinori. Well... How these final live reactions work is um, we are just going to go straight into the live reaction. And uh, after it's done, we'll give our thoughts on how it ended. And, um, well, on the final chapter and how uh, it ended and the series as a whole. But let's get to chapter 18 first. See what's in store for us today and see how this is going to end. So chapter 18 is titled Crimson Awakening. Go well, back to the fight with Shion. Woo! God, now you really pissed me off. Ooh, this fire art looks nice. It looks okay. It's still stiff. Mr. Azzle! Mr. Azzle! That won't work. Huh? Woo! God! Ooh, baby dra. That dragon, is that, is that his nightmare? I get it. The dragon's power makes him resistance to, resistant to flames, huh? Thanks, baby draw. Promise roar. That this fire don't look that bad. Could look better, um, color palette wise, but the shape looks really good. Not mad at this. Er, impressive. Those are Mr. Azzle's flames. <laughs> These are only lukewarm. Your flames are just too weak. A little stiff, but this is definitely better. Let me show you how to turn up the heat. Woo! Not done yet. Mmm. Ooh. Come. Ooh. Don't get cocky after all. You're just a fake monster born from humanity's dreams. It's still a little stiff, but it's not, I'll take it. The fire looks good, though. I'll give you that, Yoshimori. Ha, 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 look at me. I'm the real nightmare here. Bro, you want, Shion, I love you, but man, you are too stiff to be, I, I can't believe you when you're saying this, when you're this stiff. Huh? What are you doing, brat? Get out of my way. I won't. Don't hurt Azul any further. I, I won't allow it. Huh? It's not over yet. Mr. Azzle. <laughs> you lost both your sword and your nightmare. You have nothing left. Do you actually think you can beat me? Azzle. No, not the dog of a flower. I saw my friends. Roo. Oh. Roo. 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 Unleash the power hidden in your body. Perfect, perfect. Then let me bring you and your friends down to hell. Shion, I love you so much. I wish your hair wasn't stiff, though. Fire actually, again, the fire, it could look better, but the fire doesn't look too bad. God, what are these flames? They feel different just now. These are the flames of a nightmare. Hmm. A dragon? A legendary nightmare. It's only temporary, but uh, I used my magic uh, to unleash his inner power. Woo! Baby Trump, I'm happy to be fighting with you again, my friend. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's beam together! Of course! All right, let's go. Let's see. So this is the final chapter here, which is titled Cherished Friends. Of course it is. Let's kick his butt together! Yes! Then let the file shut up again! Woo! Now this is what I'm talking about. This is fire. This is fire! Ha! Where the hell are you aiming? Just give it up! 
Now this is what I have been looking for. This is not so stiff. This is so much better. God! Ooh. Damn it all. You should have died a long time ago, bastard. Moon arrow. Ooh, what? I can still fight too. You little bitch. Then I'll kill you first. Ooh. Dragon's like, not today, bitch. I will say this. Uh, you know what? No, I have to say. The Awakening, though, I wish it was more like Togen Anki when uh, Shiki had his um, Child of Kishin Awakening when he was surrounded by those abstract flames. But God damn it, I can't get over how much of a digi like a digivolution this is. This is a digivolution, man! It is! And you can make the argument that this is a mega, evo uh, mega evolution as well for if you want to go the Pokemon route. But God, it feels like a digivolution. You may be huge... But a bed is still a bed, so stay out of this! Shion, I goddamn love you. Grr. Yeah! Mr. Asshole! That broken sword can't help you anymore. You can't fight alongside your nightmare if your weapon is broken. But the more you trust your nightmare, the stronger the power it could give you. Woo! Now this! Now this I could get behind. This looks good. Again, I wish there was more black and gray in this fire, but the pose looks good. I am down with this pose. His sword is his broken sword is back to normal? No, it evolved? Ah, finally! How is it I'm finally getting what I want out of this manga? Well, for the most part, but like the final chapter. Moongar is the strongest country of them all! A mere Nightwalker like you will never be able to beat us! Ooh. Countries? Wars? I don't know anything about them. No! Not the better! No! All I need is a group of friends to go on adventures with. This panel is fucking fierce, though. I will say that. Prominence Roar! I need more from the, I need more from this fire. But the pose? It looks fine. It looks better. Mr. Azzle, uh, he actually did it. Oh. Aw. Thank you, Emma. You should really take a rest now. Your wounds are deep, but your vials are unharmed. It would seem um, you are in no serious condition. That being said, please don't overdo it anymore, Prince Oliver. Eh, maybe they still have a use for me and therefore didn't kill me. But even after Shion's statements, uh, Moonguard's goal is still shrouded in mystery. By the way, what about Asl and the others? I still have to thank them for saving me. <laughs> they have already left for a new adventure. Ah, so maybe this is more of a Pokemon kind of thing. Yo, we're so high up! This feels great! Let's go cut looking for Emma's sister next! Uh, thanks! And we still need to get, um, Miru's memories back! Yes! Well, well then, let's continue our adventure! Nightmares are born- are monsters born from humanity's dreams, but in this world they may also turn out to be cherished friends. Yoshinori, I am sorry that this manga ended. I am. But for this ending, I'm not too mad at it. I It sucks. I'm just talking about in the context of, ha of it being, um, getting the early chop. It's not fair that Dora Duranron is still going, because that's a soulless piece of crap. But, that's what it is. The thing is with this manga, I want to say, because I have to compare it to Token Anki, because Token Anki is still going. The thing that Token Anki has that I think this manga didn't have is the, I, I don't think the writing was strong enough for this. Where, because I keep comparing this to Token Anki because it had this, it has the same problem with the art. Because um, the art was very, in Token Anki up until not too long ago, the art was very, very stiff. And, um, there's problem. there's still problems with the facial expressions. Trust me, there is. And there's still problems with movement. And I give Urushibara a lot of shit for it. 
But we're starting to get somewhere with the oh, we're really starting to get somewhere with this art. And the blood art used to be terrible, but it's better now. But the thing that Togenaki has going for it, and I think a lot of people like it for this reason, and still and I've stayed around with it for this reason, is because the writing is so good. That's the problem with this one, is the writing, I don't think, could compensate, unlike Token Anki, where the writing was able to compensate for, um, for Token Anki, the writing here wasn't strong enough to compensate for the art. Because you could have a really crappy story, but still have gorgeous art to kind of compensate for it. But this, I don't think it had it. Had it. That's the problem. That is really the problem. Especially, like, when you compare this to, like, Mashima's other series that are going. Like, with Eden Zero or, or 100 Years Quest. And Atsubo is doing, drawing 100 Years Quest. With Eden Zero, what Mashima is doing there is just so incredible. Eden Zero is so goddamn revolutionary. I love what Mashima is doing with Eden Zero. With the story and with the art. He is pushing himself with it. Atsuo, what, um, what's going on with 100 Years Quest? The art... Atsuo's getting really better with... Oh, the art's getting so much better in 100 Years Quest. But the story that... I think Mashima still works on the um, on the writing with it. Uh, for um, 100 Years Quest. Kind of like with um, what has happened like with Boruto and with... Uh, well, not Boruto anymore because... <laughs> um, Kishimoto is now, um, and Toriyama too with Dragon Ball is like full time on that writing. But the writing for um, 100 Years Quest is just incredible. It took what was wrong with Fairy Tail and like made it even better. It's such a good series. But this, I think the writing was just too safe. That's the problem. This series did not take any risks. And that is the pro that is a huge problem. This manga needed to take more risks with the uh, with the writing and with the art. Togenaki, you had a lot of risks going on. You you have a lot of risks going on. You have a lot of uh, really good storytelling going on. The oh, the writing is so good, Togenaki. I know the art don't reflect it as much as it should. I'm giving Arushibara a lot of shit for it too, but it's getting there. It is. For Yoshinori, I hope that you take a look at, um, reflect on what you did here, and take a look at some, uh, take a look at Mashima's other works, um, take a look at uh, Eden Zero, take a look at 100, uh, look at what Atsuo are doing in 100 Years Quest, take a look at what Nakaba is doing in Four Nights of the Apocalypse. What Four Nights of the Apocalypse is doing is incredible. It's fucked up at times, but. And Nakaba getting shit for it, which I think is stupid. Leave Nakaba alone. God damn, just because you don't like something in the story doesn't mean you should attack Nakaba for it. Jesus Christ. What Nakaba is doing, though, and maybe it's a good... <laughs> it sucks that Nakaba getting attacked, but it's making people feel a certain way, which is what art is supposed to do. Whether you're pissed off about it or not, hey, Nakaba did what, <laughs> Nakaba did what he was doing. Do what it's supposed to do. Make you feel a certain way. This manga, I didn't... That's the one thing I didn't get with this one. I didn't feel anything. I didn't feel anything that I should have felt. And that's... That's, I think, what the problem is. I don't know what was going on. I don't know what's go what was going on on Yoshinori's end. Another one... Oh, another one that I should say that... Um, that the art wasn't always the greatest thing in the world but still was really good and I loved covering it because it really made me feel something. Um, and what really compensated for it was the writing was Abyss Rage. That's another one. Oh, Abyss Rage is so good. That writing, so that's why I say, sometimes you could have bad art, but if you have the writing to back it up, that's something I can work with. That's something that people will like, I mean, look at One Punch Man's webcomic and look at Mob Psycho 100. People like good stories. They can deal with bad art if you give a good story. But I think that, as I said, I think that's what the problem was here. The writing wasn't good enough to uh, make up for the art. And that sucks.
really does because I re- there was some really good concepts here. It just wasn't executed um, well enough. But anyways, I'm very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. Love what we're doing. I want to help keep this channel alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more manga content or, and anime content. You guys can do that. Donate to our Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wishlist. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.